Google has released a brand new free AI tool called Illuminate, and it may change how you create and consume audio and create podcasts from research papers and documents. You can search for a topic, select papers to include in your podcast, and then customize the tone and duration of the podcast. The program also allows you to view the transcript of the podcast and share it with others. I think Illuminate is a great example of how AI tools can be used to make complex information more accessible to a wider audience. I believe that AI has the potential to revolutionize the way we learn, and I'm excited to see what the future holds. It's powered by Google's latest AI Gemini models. Now, let me show you around Illuminate. You can access it at illuminate.google.com. Now, let me show you how to use it. Let's go. Into showing you how Illuminate works. Um, it uses Google's Gemini models in the background, so you know that it's gonna be really powerful generative AI. Um, as you log into the uh, system, you'll see a number of pre-made voice recording and podcasts that have been outputted and um, some of them are really good and um, I've had to listen to a few of them so um, what you'll see over here is obviously a number that you can see over here and um, if you wanted to start creating your own you'll click on start generating but let's just go over here first so if you wanted to understand what's been created you click on the view source and this is the PDF that's been created all right at the moment it's using um, ARXIV org PDFs um, and that is one of the trusted sources of information that they allow you to use here. All right, you can also view the transcript of what the podcast is about, and you can ultimately play the podcast. All right, so you can also download the particular podcast if you want to listen to it later or upload it to your um, uh, streaming device. Um, you can also go in and um, now you can start interacting with it. So you can click on this little hand button to ask a question. All right, so let's hit that little hand button and you can say, no, let's just click this one over here. All right, it will basically um, get the information from the PDF and or any information that's in the podcast itself. So really powerful stuff that you can use um, Illuminate for. All right, so what we're gonna do now is, all right, so what we've done is had a look at how the um, existing ones work and um, a little bit of interactivity and features that you can do. And um, let's go and create our own one now. So if you hit the generate button on the left-hand side, um, it'll take you to generate a conversation. And um, in the library over here is anything that you've created for yourself. So let's go back to generate and let's search for a topic or paste a PDF URL. All right, so there's just a disclaimer over here. Um, it's optimized for computer science projects and it may pronounce um, items incorrectly. All right, let's just have a look at the help content. Uh, let's just click on that, how to use Illuminate, all right. So at the moment, what's available is um, published research papers on the website arxiv.org. All right, um, this is um, this is actually quite great because this is, means that it's grounded in information, it's factual, and the um, provider is an incredible source. All right, I mean the problem that we're going to face in the future is AI content being generated or for AI generated content and um, I think this is an absolutely fantastic way to make sure that the information is correct and factual. All right, um, okay, so it's basically telling you how to do it and what it's all about. All right, so let's just type in here AI for business. All right, let's hit enter. And what it's gonna do now is it's gonna go and search the arxif.org database for any information um, that it's got on business use. All right, uh, so we've got the unlocking AI for business applications. All right, let's have a look at this one over here. Building AI innovation labs together with companies. All right, let's hit that one over there. And if you wanted to add another uh, source, you could potentially do that. So you can just click on um, early adoption of generative AI by global leaders. All right, so we're gonna create a podcast of building innovation labs as well as early adoption. All right, so let's click on add. All right, now what you can see over here is the two sources that we've got that's made available to us. 
And on the right hand side is where your prompt is ultimately going to be. Wherever you see the little box is information that you can change. All right, so create a discussion for a general audience, or if you want to say this is a student audience or a um, business leader, um, yeah, you can change that there with a short duration, you can be medium duration, long duration, etc. Um, and the tone should be semi professional. All right, so let's click on generate down over here at the bottom and what it will do is it will go into the background and start creating a discussion of these two particular papers all right okay so what it's done now is it's popped uh, so it's now basically taken the discussion of those two particular papers what you can do from here is you can edit regenerate or download it so let's just edit this name over here to something that we had um, previously done so this is going to be the implementation and adoption this is called this draft and hit the save button all right so as you can see now you can change your i am um, your, your the name of it all right you can view the transcript if you'd like all right so it's basically what it's done now it's created a host it's created a guest and um it's basically created some uh, main uh, some material for you if you want to look at the sources you can click on the sources and you can click on these links over here so let's just go open link in a new tab and let's go have a squiz at that all right and here's the um, particular pdf that was created all right what we can do now is click on the play button all right so once you've had a bit of a play and you've listened to it it's pretty cool um really powerful i'm, I'm actually quite uh, quite impressed with what it's done all right you can now download it as i said and also if you wanted to you can click on the hand and what are the examples of our misuse what are the benefits what are the steps um so let's just hit that button over there and ultimately what it's going to do is it's going to start chatting with the two documents and um, ultimately give you some answers all right so really powerful um, that's all i've got for you for today um, have a play around with it and um, i'm pretty sure that in the future they're going to be adding more sources and more research papers into the library and um, yeah have a look at it and i think you'd be quite impressed with what's going on here so thank you for watching uh, if you enjoy this video like subscribe